I'm Ashley Allen here in the Nesson studios with Nesson.com's Red Sox beat writer, Ricky Doyle. So Ricky, today we're talking about the best tools in the Red Sox lineup. So Red Sox fans all know that David Ortiz has unbelievable home run potential, but who else can kind of flex their muscles at the plate? Well, there's certainly no shortage of power in the Red Sox lineup, which is pretty impressive when you consider the fact that power is really one of the most sought after commodities in all of Major League Baseball. And outside of Ortiz, there are plenty of guys that can, like you said, flex their muscle. Mike Napoli being one guy we know what kind of light tower power he has. Uh, I was surprised by the amount of power that Pablo Santa, Sandoval has when I was down in spring training a few weeks ago. Uh, also, Ruzne Castillo, he showed flashes of power down the stretch last season. But for me, there, you know, there are certain guys that the ball just kind of jumps off their bat and their batting practice sessions are kind of a, a spectacle, I guess you could say. And last season, you know, Joanna Cespedes was a guy like that. But this season for me, it's Hanley Ramirez. I mean, this guy showed up to camp absolutely massive. He's jacked out of his mind and really just drills the ball with a lot of authority. So I think you're going to see his power on display a lot this season at Fenway Park. All right, let's talk about speed. So Jacoby Ellsbury held the title for Boston's fastest player for the entire time he was there. Who holds the title now? Uh, it's got to be Mookie Betts. Uh, this guy, as we've seen this spring, can pretty much do it all. And one of his best assets is his speed. Really just a, a perfect guy to hit atop the order when you combine his speed with his on-base ability. Okay, so plate discipline. The Red Sox are a team that typically like to work counts. With that in mind, who do you think has the best plate discipline? One guy that I'm anxious to see what kind of plate discipline he has this season is Xander Bogarts because he had, a, you know, he has a minor league track record of having a great eye, and then he came up in the World Series in 2013 and just, you know, was laying off pitches that were about an inch off the edge, and now it, there are some questions about his plate discipline. So if he, you know, takes the next step this season, I think that. Uh, He'll be right up in that conversation for in terms of who has the best eye in the Red Sox. All right, well, thank you so much for being with us. I'm Ashley Allen. This is Ricky Doyle. For all your Red Sox news, keep it at Nesson.com. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube page, and if you want to read more, head over this way.